Hello, everybody. For week four, three, we are going to work on helping verbs. So thinking back to last week, it was all about linking verbs, verbs that connect the subject with something about the subject. Helping verbs are kind of similar. However, they actually help a main verb tell the tense. So helping verbs like have, has, and had all help tell when the verb happens. So taking a look here, sometimes a verb can be more than one word. Cleaned is the verb, but we have the helping verb here to show that it has cleaned. The main verb tells what the subject is or does. So cleaned is what we would call the main verb. Then the helping verb helps show the action. It helps tell when the verb takes place. Has is the helping verb in this example. Have, has, had are all different helping verbs. And they do have to agree with the subject. For example, you can say John has finished his chores. You can't say John have finished his chores. It has to make sense with the subject. Let's do a couple of examples. <clears throat> Number one, all the puppies have barked at me. First, I want you to find the main verb, barked. That's the main action taking place. And then look and see where that helping verb is. That helps tell when the action takes place. All the puppies have barked at me. It already happened in the past. Number two, my brother has borrowed my bike. Borrowed is my main verb. Has is the helping verb. And remember, we can't say my brother have borrowed or my brother had borrowed. It is my brother has borrowed. It has rained all day. Where's my main verb? Rained. And what's the helping verb? Has. Last one, number four. We had asked for help with our homework. Asked is our main verb. Had is our helping verb. So that's what we'll be taking a look at this week. In your uh, worksheet, you just simply need to choose which helping verb fits in the sentence. Try them both out and listen to which one makes sense. We'll do number one together. Spartina blank turned into a problem. Spartina have turned into a problem, or Spartina has turned into a problem? Right. Spartina has turned into a problem. Use the skill box up at the top if you need to remember what you're working on and really listen to which one sounds right. The last one we're going to do together is number two. It blank lived in Washington since the 1800s. It has lived in Washington since the 1800s, or it have lived in Washington since the 1800s. Again, you need the helping verb has. It has lived. Go ahead and finish numbers 3 through 15, and then come on back and correct.